Hi, today I will show you how to use your CDs that you no longer use to make something like this for your table. The way you do this, you're going to need a fine needle, a crochet needle, and you can get this in any fabric store or even Walmart. You're going to need your disc and you're going to need your thread, your crochet thread. You can use any type of thread. You can also use yarn if you wish, but if you use yarn, you're going to have to use a bigger hook. So today, the first step is you're going to put your thread through the center and you're going to make a knot. I'm going to make a double knot that way it doesn't come loose. To do this, you also need to have like a basic knowledge of crochet. Um, it's not very hard, but it will help. You do two chain. What I do, I will hold the back, bring your needle down, bring that thread, and put it through the loop there. Now you make two crochet chain, one, two. Now hold your your, your uh, thread in the back you bring that if you miss if you lose it that's okay you can get it and just put it through Bring it down. You just keep doing all around. Once it's all around the disc, you put as many as you want. You're going to be doing the lace for the border. And I'm going to show you how to do that. The lace is very easy to make. What you do You're going to do a chain of five. Then you're going to skip one and do a crochet. Now you're going to do five chain. One, two, three, four, and five. Skip one. Same thing. One, two, three, four, and five. And you're going to do this all around the disc. Um, you can do as many rows as you want um, all over. And when you're done with this circle, you do the second one the same way, the third one, and just do it as many as you want. Now, at the end, 
I like to put the little decoration. You can even make a full flower or you can just make this, which it makes it look nice. You can also put some starch once it's done and uh, it will make it look really nice. So I'm gonna show you how to do this little loop in the end. You're gonna do five, one, two, three, four, and five. You're gonna do a crochet here, regular one, regular stitch. Then you're gonna do five, Then here you're gonna do the little loop. If you do one, it's gonna look the same as this. See, you do four. One, two, three, four. Then put it through. You see how it looks? If you wanna do two more, it will resemble a flower. Uh, but Today I'm just going to do it the simple way. So I'll go and do five more. One, two, three, four, five. I will pick the next one. I will do five more. And here is where I do my loop. I do four. Then five. You can do whatever boarding you like to do. You just have to use your imagination. Um, in here, I did something different. What I did was a row of a straight crochet. And then I did the same thing I did here. So this one kind of looks different. But you can use any idea you have and this mat can be used for Christmas um, you can make a full table mat and use a few of them just make a few of this and put them together and it will look really nice you can also do a wall hanging and put a string there and a point center there and maybe glue some little Christmas decoration and it will look very nice. Uh, you can use this as um, toilets to put like a decoration, something there for your table. You can use it as a coaster. You can even use the wool to make um, something like this for Christmas and it will look very nice and it also will be easier to make the wool is easier to crochet um, I think that's it for now I hope that you don't have any problems and if you have any questions just write to me and I'll answer your question thank you so much for watching my video good luck bye